Hello and welcome to my Yu-Gi-Oh! channel. Today we're doing a little bit of a public service announcement for anyone who is a current judge. It says for a reminder for the LA judges to complete the PC1. So if you've judged a tier 3 event, you need to read this. Juliet Hedberg, head of the Konami Judge Program, has recently made a post on social media encouraging judges to complete the policy comprehension test. Specifically, the post states that any judge in the North American or Latin American region that has judged a Tier 3 event, this includes a YCS, a WCQ, a UDS Invitational, should pass the PC1 test available online before the end of the week. This is followed by a comment emphasising the importance of doing this. Currently only the first ruling comprehension, the RC1 test is mandatory for membership in the judge program, although the PC1 test is heavily encouraged. Both of them you'll be able to find the details and I will actually link that as part of the description. I don't know what the relevance of this is, perhaps because a lot of this year has meant that we've had remote duels where maybe judges have been less present or have been less active. That has meant some of them have lost some of those skills to identify some of the newer cards and some of how they interact with each other. That might be a reason why there's been a bit of urgency held towards these. Otherwise, I'm not necessarily sure why this has been announced. I also think it's a way of identifying who the, some of the stronger judges are against some of the weaker ones and then pairing those towards the events that are probably a bit more friendly towards their skill set. So, for example, you might have some of the judges that are a bit weaker go to smaller based events to get a bit more practice, whereas you might have some of the big main events held by some of the strongest ones where they're less likely to make mistakes, there's less likely to be any disqualifications, and there's going to be less contention about who actually wins overall within those events. What do you guys think of this? Are you a judge yourself? Are you actually aware of this? And I have you actually taken the test as is necessary? Or did you not know about this and are actually a bit grateful to actually learn about this? Whatever you think, leave those comments down below. Like the video if you enjoyed it. And don't forget to subscribe for more daily Yu-Gi-Oh! content.